Hello everyone, this is Siddhi from Radiance Academy. In this video, we'll talk about classification of plants. So, let's get started. Biology deals with the studies of living things such as plants, animals and humans. Biologists have defined, named and grouped more than a million types of plants and animals living on this Earth. In order to, with, this, with the study of this variety of plants and animals, they have been classified into different groups. Classification and Needs All living things are classified into plants and animals. Based on their similar characteristics, both plants and animals are further divided into groups. On the basis of grouping, the living organisms can be studied systematically. Classification means grouping of organisms together on the basis of certain common features. It is the process of putting organisms of similar characteristics into one group. Classification is a system of arranging living organisms into groups based on their similar characteristics. Now, what are the advantages of classification? Classification. It is not humanly possible to study all the plants and animals that exist in the world. So, the scientists have made this job easier by classifying them into different groups. The characteristics of all members of the group can be understood by studying only the characteristics of a few members. Classification makes the study systematic. It highlights the relationship between different organisms. Classification also helps in identifying different organisms and placing them into particular groups. It also gives us an idea about the evolution of organisms from simpler to more complex forms. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for such more videos. Thank you.